Hey everyone, Richard here, and today I'm going to start a tag. Uh, this tag came from a conversation I was having where we were talking about sort of the cover wars that we keep seeing happening, uh, best covers, and how often a good cover will be overshadowed by a grail or a key issue or something um, that not isn't necessarily a better cover, but it has more uh, recognition to it and it kind of defaults itself into a winning position by doing so. So for this tag I decided I wanted to see books that people think are great covers that are worth less than $20. Um, you can show as many as you want, uh, you can show as few as you want, but it just I think it'd be cool to see really good covers on books that are actually affordable uh, and that are based more on the actual cover than some sort of keynote. Uh, so yeah, let's just let's just do it. I'm gonna show a few, and yeah, first one. Uh, this is West Coast Avengers 21. Uh, people try to ask money for this for some silly reason, but it sells for less than ten dollars all the time, and it's just a really nice Moon Knight cover. Nice black cover, and yeah, that'll be the first one. Next one, we got Animal Man 15, I believe. Yeah, 15. This is a Bullen cover. Uh, I like this cover for a number of reasons. One, it's just a really nice dolphin cover. Uh, but it also sort of homages her first appearance with the colors in the background. And even sort of the layout of the book. It's just now has this, I guess, tragic uh, scenario to it. Uh, it's, it's kind of an interesting homage slash not homage cover that can be found for relatively cheap. And dolphin doesn't have a ton of appearances. So, nice book. Next book, I have shown this one semi-recently, New Mutants 28. Uh, just a really, really nice Jorge Molina cover. Uh, I just love how defiant she looks at these beasts. Like, it's just an all-around good cover. And it's pretty affordable. Next up, Fairest, number 31. Uh, Adam Hughes has quite a few covers in this, this uh, series. Uh, but I think this one's a bit underrated. I just... I don't know, I like how creative he was with his signature placement in this. Um, not necessarily the, the placement, but the idea of putting it, working it into the image, as opposed to just tacking it on the side somewhere. Uh, it's just a really nice cover. Next up, we got Spider-Gwen Annual Number 1. And it's just, I just like how vibrant this, this cover is, and how her, uh, Costume self is sort of in the silhouette of her ordinary self. Just really like that one. Got another Adam Hughes cover, but uh, this one's Star Wars Purge. Just in a really, really cool Vader cover. Uh, and unrelated to this tag, but it actually has a pretty decent story as well. And the last one I am going to show is X-Force, Sex and Violence, number one. Honestly, any of these Sex and Violence uh, covers could have probably made it into this, because they're all relatively affordable. Um, this one wanted out because I like that you see the reflection of this happening in over here. I don't know, I just think it's a, a nice concept. But yeah, that's, that's going to be the, the covers I show. Um, real simple tag, real fast. Show some covers you like that are under $20. Past Richard got a little distracted in this part, so uh, Editor Richard right here is going to tag a few people because I, yeah, got sidetracked. So let's go with Kingdom Comics, uh, Mr. Rick Mortis 86, uh, Walking Jedi, 64-page uh, special, Slim Comics and more. And yeah, anyone else, go for it. It's supposed to be fun. So yeah, hopefully you all enjoy this, and I look forward to seeing your videos. Take care, everyone.